Well, good day everyone. We are at Panawanica. So we're in little transit caravan spots. It's only four spots here. Maximum stays three days, $30 a night. And essentially you get the run of the town's facilities, which is fantastic. So you've got this across here, you've got bar, it's the school, and you've got basketball courts and under area there. The tennis, if you want to play tennis, you've got the footy oval. Um, at the top there is the sports bar. And then you get around the back, and behind us is another playground and the BMX track. So, uh, the town was founded in 1970, I think, and this year it's its 50th birthday. So, we've got to be out early in the morning to um, so they can get ready for their 50th birthday party. So right where we are, apparently there's a stage, rock band coming. I think someone said the Hoodoo Gurus. It'd be pretty cool, actually. Um, a bit of catering for the whole town and all the mine workers. So um, we have a friend who lives here and he's just on top of the hill. Um, he came down last night for a couple of beers, but we come here 12 months ago after the cyclone and we thought, you know, what the hell? Let's come back and have another go because I actually really enjoyed it. So the boys can run around. It's got that 1980s feel about it where kids can um, just play until dark and they go back home, um, which is pretty cool. So I'm going to go for a walk and find out where my family have gone because I believe they were going to go for a swim. Let's go. See, so a school. Playgrounds everywhere. There's another playground here. Pretty well catered. The town is small and you can walk from all the places within 10 minutes. So I don't think you've got any further than the playground. Maybe the pool's closed. Let's see. Every second house has got a caravan and a boat and that because it's a mining town, so there's not much else you can do here with your money, I suppose. So there's a playground here. Down here, there's another playground. So it's got an outdoor cinema, a tavern, the sports bar, post office, a normal supermarket. It's got a garden, community centre. It has pool, a gym, a library, medical centre, a police station. What? Oh yeah, we had a power outage at 4am this morning, didn't we? Well, let's go for a walk, come on. It's another playground, so this is playground number... Yeah, that's all, play outside. Playground number four. And we're only walked 50 metres from the bloody caravan. Maybe 100 metres. Come on. Let's go and check this place out. It's all path there is. Green grass. A lot of push bikes here, so people just ride their bikes to places. They don't really drive anywhere. Why well, wouldn't you? To be honest. For me, I would have an e-scooter. Cruise around an e-scooter. A lot of people are out of here for a few days because there's a rodeo on in Onslow, which we couldn't get any accommodation there because we didn't do our research properly. And silly ass didn't work on um, work on that. There was actually some stuff going on. Caratha, there was a there's a horse riding competition on. Um, so that's why Caratha was booked out. We got two two nights here, which is really good. They said so that looks like the gym, doesn't it? You gym it up, you gotta get fit and get a body like this, not going to the gym. <laughs> a lot of people coming in here, there's nowhere to stay unless they give them some extra space because it's Forbes 13 crew. So they've got their community notice board here. What's going on? There we go. So 50th anniversary, 
and there's the anniversary of the mine opening, so on Thursday the 11th of happening. And there's the Mesa J Mine bus tour, which you can do. We won't be here then, we'll be, by then we'll be pretty well close to Exmoor. And you got the fun family celebrations, Friday 12th of August here at the Rock. So, Groove Night Avenue. There you go. So it's not the Hoodoos. That's all right, man. Cool. Indoor triathlon. Mixed social soccer. There's all sorts of stuff going on. It's pretty cool. There's the actions on the other side of the board there and what's happening for the week. That's a cafe. Let's go check it out. Do you want a coffee? Or do you want a... Uh, there's a cafe. And then we'll head down. The shops are down this way. Pools over there, so we're still in the same precinct. We haven't really moved much further, just where we're at. We're going under here. You got the supermarket down here. Another what's on board, tells you what's going on. And then you've got in here. Fresh fruit and veg, bottle shop. Um, also have scratchies and other bits and pieces. She went there yesterday for that. And we've got, we've got the community centre here and Pindigub. They're doing Kairos on Thursdays. So you know what? That is essentially everything in this area, isn't it, boys? Yeah. Yep. Cool. Let's right. head back for mum. Yeah. Behind me, there's a few caravans there. Looks like they're doing a dirt tour before it gets sealed, so they've all been on the been off the black stuff and onto the red. It's pretty cool. All different types of camper trailers, different makes, and they're all filthy, so they've been somewhere. Look at this. Oh, Swanee B sign. So we've got a couple of community places up there, the medical centers up there. And this is the tavern. Which we will come back this afternoon. And have a cheeky pint or two, I think. For the afternoon session, watch a bit of footy. I don't know. So, pretty much that's the town. We're gonna go back, the boys are gonna jump in the pool. Now oh, we've still got five minutes. Oh, we've we'll just walked the town. How's that? Excited? Oh, yeah. Yeah? Enjoying it? Always excited. Washing's done. Yep. Maybe you can uh, jump in the van today and make us some scones. Or will they turn out to be rock eggs? No, just be nothing now. <laughs> <laughs> They've just done a trip through Kew up to Millstream and they've crossed over um, a few creek and riverbeds. That's why their cars are filthy, so they don't worry about cleaning it and then they're heading back south now. So. On a big tour, looks like they've had a bit of fun, so which is good. Those camper trailers, they've got them into all sorts of places, he said, so outstanding. Well done. The dirt, you can see the tide mark on the car where they've been through a river crossing, about halfway up the door. But, um, I don't know. Is the pool open yet? Oh, what is going on? Are we on Penna time. Go. Not too...
Now is it? It's not cold. Isn't it? You would be able to hop in them. Oh wow. But you didn't pull a face like it was freezing. Mm. Jensen's a bit sook and he's not getting Jensen's in. Jensen's cold. Hop in, Jensen. Oh. Get in, Jensen. <laughs> We've been for a swim and now we're at the Tav. What have you got, my love? Prosecco. A bit of Prosecco. <laughs> I've got a bit of Cooper's Dry Thrifting 5. Just for that's you. The boys have got fruit boxes. I reckon I'm guessing you've got 20D. And the Bundy Lime and Lemon Lime and Bitters. Yeah, cool. So we're going to wait for the food to turn up. Some of games and Superbikes, they're all good. It's a kid's meal. What's a kid's meal? For ten dollars at the Pano Tavern. This is the adult size. Anything else coming out? Look at that. It's really old Viscount's come to retire. This one there. One in the backyard here. How cool is that? So there's the uh, movie cinema area. And then on this side we've got a big truck. Head down to town. We're about to go and fuel up. Right, oh, that's uh, Panawanica done. We're just outside the um, Robe River Rodeo Arena. Um, I think they have this every year in September. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'll be, I'll double check that. Uh, people come from everywhere for it. it's a huge event, and then they all camp all the way out and around here. So we thought we've. Um, We'd finish off here. So good little town. Um, we just paid a dollar ninety nine for diesel. A dollar ninety nine, cheapest on tour. Unbelievable. So thanks for watching this little one. It's only a short one, but thanks for watching. What do you do? Like and subscribe. Yeah, and uh, we'll see you on the next video, which will hopefully be the last station. We'll wait and see. All right, take care. Go, mate, go. Bye. <laughs>